What is going on, guys? This is Azaden, and welcome back to Elden Ring, where we just left off. Oh, there's like some... Interesting. Where we left off, we killed the Mimic tier and died a few times trying to make the jump at the, at the end of this bridge. Sorry, I'm just looking down there. And I see an enemy there, which means that you can get there. I think we came in over there, so... I don't know. Maybe something we'll find later. Or maybe we'll never find it at all. Who knows? Ooh, butterflies. Is that just not the epitome of ADD? Ooh, look a butterfly. I'm just sort of getting my lay of the land again. I want to check today to see if there's any messages. And then I think I'm going to light this lantern first. Gorgeous view. No jumping ahead. Uh, magic. Okay, um, so there's a message on there. I don't know, maybe I'll try it off cam. Because I feel like it's going to take me a few. I'm not very good at plat 3D platforming like that, so. I'm going to go with Great Shard. Unless this somehow activates something down there. You know... God, I'm going to regret this. This is so much, like, closer in terms of height. I'm going to regret this, aren't I? Alright, let's get, get an eye on my target there. Okay. Come on. Hey, look at that. We did it. Eagle down here. Get out of my way. If there's nothing down here, I'm gonna be a little mad. Hey, there's something down here. Including an excellent view. Wow. Now, if the no fall damage ring actually had no fall damage, we could just jump all the way down. I don't like that it exposes the re the repeating um, texture of the water. Which is a pretty common thing in games. Like, it's not entirely disappointing, but it's not something you want to see actively. A uh, safety battle. All right, so this says precious item I had, but like, how mostly? That doesn't look traversable. Ooh, hello. Alright. Top off and check this out. Nope. We can always tra fast travel back. 
Behold Edge. Yeah, duh. Thanks. I'm not seeing anything down here, and I feel like this is somewhere that we would have already explored. But I'm just trying to figure out how we would have... Yeah, no. There's nothing that would have gotten us here. So... All right. Ooh, hello. Clarifying Horn Charm plus one. What the freak does that do? Greatly raises focus. I don't even know what focus does. But from 253 to 393, um... Focus is your resistance to sleep and bouts of madness. Okay, so that's something that literally I have not had any use for at any point. Perfect. And some Celestial Dew. It's the uh, the in-game branded version of Mountain Dew. I wonder if I've already made that joke. <laughs> fast. Item ahead. Another level 5 smith and stone. Alright. So far so good. So here I am, on top of the abandoned merchant. Pretty cool how they layered these. Oh, look at that. It's like upside down over there. Alright, so I think that that's about it for this little area. Oh. Except that I'm blind and dumb. Ah, oh, that's not much. Head back to the Mimic tier site of Grace here and actually get on with it. I feel like that side of Grace moves a little bit every time I go to it. My eye is itchy. God. Not a fan. Oh, great. Takes three. Alright, Captain Moo Moo. Let's all just be chill, okay? What 
What up, my dude? Lord of Blood, your eminence. I beg you, grant me a seat at the table of the dynasty. Long live the Mogwin dynasty. Long live the Mogwin dynasty! Okay, so I take it we gotta get over there and kill some dude named Mogwin? Or someone from the Mogwin dynasty? Ah, just having a sip. Drinking Fresca tonight. Alright, well this seems like an obvious we need to go here as well. Or is this just the way that you're supposed to go to get on here? Okay, so I'm an idiot twice over. That's great. We're doing well on the uh, on the dumb counter this episode. But am I going to go for a third round of dumb? Because that does actually look traversable. Yeah. I tell you, there's no way back up. No, I can't get that high. Back to the Mimic tier. <laughs> okay. I swear we'll go the way we're supposed to now. I just like exploring. I can't help it. Alright, we've got to go and find out what that, uh, what that guy does. That one minotaur with the aura around him. That's singing again. Is it the Minotaur? Up. What the hell? You hit the fucking enemy? Okay. So it was the Minotaur singing. It was a lady minotaur. Okay, so here's how we get on that thing that I was seeing earlier. Let's go... I think there's a beacon here, though, so let's go like that. Goitus. All right, let's carry on. Whoop. Whoop. All right. Beware of jumping in. Oh shit. Let's check the left first. Alright, yeah, no way around. 
Shadows on PS4 version are weird. Like, look at that ambient occlusion. Blah, 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 blah. But it runs so much better on PS4. I think after I finish this playthrough, I am going to transition to the PC. Because I've, A, upgraded my processor, and B, the PC version has improved quite a bit. We'll see how I feel, though. Most of the graphics on the PS4 version running on the PS5 are really good. So. Behold, dog. What? I, I don't, I don't get it. Oh. Hello. Ow. <laughs> I love Magic Glint Blade. Once you realize how it works, it's it's good stuff. Rune Arc. I should probably use one of those at some point. This is weird. You can actually go up. Like, just walk up the stairs for the most part. That's strange. Would not expect that. Um... Okay, so you definitely... there is stuff that way. You gotta make the... the crazy jump. Can't use your horse. Woo! More Mountain Dew. So that I can do the do. I know, I know, I'm lame. You gotta get with it, though, okay? If you're not with it, then... I don't know, why are you here? <laughs> Woo! Okay, we did it. Fire ahead. Thought we'd get over there, but we aren't getting over there, so okay. Oop. I love the phantoms, man. Just knowing that some other dude is like doing this with me. That doesn't look safe. Fuck it. Alright. Okay. That's alright. I'm really glad that they didn't go with, like, HP reduction. Like, Dark Souls... So, Demon Souls, Dark Souls 2, and Dark Souls 3, though in a slightly different way, all did the whole your HP reduces when you die thing. Technically, in uh, Dark Souls 3, it's reduced when you're on... It, it's increased when you're embered. But that's... That's a small distinction. Really, what's going on is it's reduced. Just with different words. Give me the silver tier. There we go. Okay. Shoom. Okay. There we go. Start your run off against the uh
Okay. <laughs> oh. Uh, pressed down. The one thing I don't like about the, uh, the fading HUD system in this game is that when the HUD is faded, you have to press a button to bring up the HUD and then press a button to actuate the HUD, which leads me to using the wrong items sometimes. It should just be, like, triangle to bring up the HUD. But if you press, like, one of your directional buttons, then it should just do... Okay, so if you press left, it does it. So it's really just up and down. So up and down are treated differently than left or left and right. That's interesting. Sorry, I'm... I'm technically minded like that. So I'm always going to be... Looking for little things like that. But it's it's weird that up and down are different than left and right. This particular area is giving me a very bloodborne -y vibe. It reminds me of the Celestials. I don't see, like... I don't know. I'm gonna go double-check that area, because that just seems weird to me. What do you say? Uh, death ahead and short turn back. Death at... Dead end ahead. Okay, so yeah. Visions of death. So it's just a MacGuffin. A red heron. Herring? Heron? One's a fish, one's a bird. <laughs> Fuck if I know which one's which, though. Ooh, nine, 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 nine. Rump ahead and then seek rump. Will do, friend. The Black Wet Blade. I wonder what that does. All the wet blades do like different things, don't they? I think they're key items. Grants choice of affinity upgrade to weapon. I don't even know what that means, man. It's probably for like elemental infusion. We're, we're using a somber. So. That looks like an enemy. Yes, use a stone sword key. Oh, hello. Why can I not? Us oh, because the thing was up. Come on. Really? Ow. Okay, you coming now? Fuck. What do we got? <sighs> Mimic Tear Ashes. Okay. That lets us, what, summon a Mimic Tear? Um, let's switch off the Jellyfish. Costs 660 HP. That is a lot.
Oh, is that already all the way down? Yeah, that's already all the way down. I want to get up there. Is there a way over there from here? Not really, eh? Worth a shot. The rock is an enemy? Oh god. Alright, let's go. That's a cool armor set. I want that. <laughs> Excuse me. Man, this area is so freaking awesome. I'm really taking... I find that I'm really taking my time with this area, but... I'm taking my time because it's just like, it's really nice. I like it a lot. It's like Dark and Orlando. Behold left. Joy ahead. Well, I guess it's, um, time to try it out. Let's quickly go to round table hold. I want to see if I can upgrade the mimic tier, and if I can, let's upgrade it to the max that we can, obviously, right? And then from there... Looking pretty empty in here. Where's my prayer guy? Oh, there's prayer guy. Hmm. Greetings. Are you here for spirit? I am here for spirit tuning. I need to warn you about something. A little while ago, someone started lurking in the wing on the opposite side of the round table. And I can hear, from all the way over there, the howling and wailing of spirits in fear of a curse. I can even hear the repulsive twisted malice in itself. A plethora of spirits in an unceasing cacophony. I can't even imagine. How much suffering inflicted to who knows how many souls. Not even the crafting caused anything like this to happen. You should keep your distance. I know you're strong, but please. I can hear it from across a house. You should keep your Okay, um... Trouble at round table hold, huh? Ah, oh, hello. You've been busy weeding death root, I take it. I thank you, as your brother in arms. So what can I do for you? Nothing really. Opposite the round table is like over here, isn't it? Oh yeah, I see him. Let's go see the finger lady first. Pick out any remembrances, because I got the remembrance from Radon. I just planned on stopping up here and upgrading the ash, but now that there's stuff happening, I want to... Uh. A 
Okay, so you can buy Radon's spear. Get Radon's armor. For this, you can get a very, very large sword, which is actually in scaling slightly. That's neat. Or a great bow. Neato. I'll do what I want. <laughs> okay. Let's try to get a great bow shot off. I don't like I don't like having to be this close, man. Have you ever felt the curse? With your whole being, the pox upon life itself. Feared and despised by all. The reviled blessing. <laughs> Apparently not. You are but a lamb. A stranger to defilement. Ignorant of your own ignorance. Is this the dung eater? You no longer interests me. I've been long without peace. Don't spoil my quietude. I asked you not to disturb me. Be thankful of the whole serenity. It is all that keeps your death and defilement at bay. I asked you, be thankful of it is all that keep Okay. I think that this dude is the the loathsome dung eater. Not I'm not trying to disturb you, I'm trying to read the damn note. Didn't expect dung. Okay, so yeah, that that I'm not mistaken. That is the dung eater. I'll enjoy your dung, you gross bitch. Well, I'm wonderful. You are a worthy fellow tarnished indeed. Make the journey to the capital, Landell, that lies to the east of the Altus Plateau, at the foot of the Earth Tree. The two fingers will deny your passage no longer. You may be our best hope. Find your way to the Elden Ring, for we are tarnished, and we must answer the call of grace. I don't want to go through all that exposition. I haven't even listened to all that exposition yet. All right, let's um. I remember there being a dude down here, but I don't remember if I killed him. Oh, you know what? Fucking do it. Loser. <laughs> well, that's much easier when you're, you know, super high level. <laughs> Also, holy crap, man. I slept on that spell for so long. Alright. Um, I'm gonna guess that it's... Knight's Sacred Ground. Alright, so we've upgraded our Mimic tier. 
Oh, me? That's so cool. Alright, me. Let's do this. Oh, hello. Soft cotton. Um, excuse me? Why you disappear? Okay, editing to the beside. No, oh, that looks not. That looks not healthy up there. Oh, I can hear more singing. Finger Slayer's Blade and Great Ghost Glovewart. What is a Finger Slayer's Blade? Probably Dagger? Ew. I don't see it anywhere. Maybe it's an item? Or maybe I just missed it? You know what? I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> Finger Slayer's Blade Elden Ring. Okay, Finger Slayer Blade... Oh, it is a key item. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. I'm not going to read the rest of the wiki entry. Hidden treasure of the eternal city of Nakron. You know what? This is probably... This is probably what Rani is looking for. Oh my god, you could hear the singing because it was coming through the portal? If that's the case, then that's like... Fucking... That, what incredible does... I'm sorry, that's impressive to me. I find that super impressive. Boom. Alright. No pretty pretty problem. It's a big ass area. Alright, me. Let's fucking do this.
Ah, seriously? I don't like all the animals. Seriously, how do you not see me? The shining horned headband. Ow. Shining horny headband. Um, so it increases poise. Does it do anything else? Decorated, worn by ancestral follower shamans. Strengthens. So ceremonial item strengthens ancestral infant's head. What? And my tear once again went away. I like the tear, but it seems expensive for just regular enemies. You know, it costs me a full charge of my flask, basically. That's essentially the cost. Like, as long as I'm not casting it when I'm in danger, the cost is one crimson, like one fruit punch. out fuck lock onto the there we go that's not good There we go. <laughs> Alright. Some hefty bones. Oh, hey, obvious boss fight arena. What up? Okay, so these are hollow horned grounds, so I need to... I need to go and find the rest of the sconces to light. animals, man. It's weird for a From Software game. For it to, like, feel alive. Brimming with some life that is actually mildly indifferent to you. Hey, gentlemen. Sorry to interrupt your picnic. Any sconces? No. Oh, hello. Okay. Let's head up.
Whoa. Holy shit. That thing just took off half my health. Oh, and he can cast fucking Glint Blade too. Awesome. Alright. Fucking get... Ah, uh, I was trying to get closer to the side of Grace before I died. What the shit? <laughs> uh, Stick America, I guess. Let's see where it is. Where the fuck am I? Seriously, that's where the Stake of America is? That's worse than the Sight of Grace by far. Alrighty. I wish that I could summon my, um... Oh, here we go. Nope, nope. Right here. I need to attract him. Perfect. Ow. What the fuck just hit me? What the hell? <laughs> Oh man, the rules for these spirit summons are like not well established to me. Okay. There we go. Hopefully that's a one-time fight. Do not want to have to fight him again. But hopefully he doesn't respawn, or if he does, hopefully we finish this area well enough to not have to fight him again. I was just eyeing those wolves down. <laughs> Giving them the business, you know? <clears throat> Excuse me. Formic rocks. <clears throat> There's a sconce up there. Alright. Sorry, I had to clear my throat even more and louder, so I muted for a second. I think... Oh, God damn it. All right. God, it's 
enchanted shot. Well, it looks like it rises or the water level falls. We will come back to that. That one's lit, that one's lit. What about over here? Jellyfish land. It's like the only place we haven't checked, I think. Old fang, huh? Check up here, and then we'll come back. Modeled necklace plus one. I think we already have modeled necklace. Let's check out what plus one does. Okay, so just raises all three of those. Got it. Right now we have slowly restores HP, raises potency, and shortens cast time. I think all of those are very, very useful. I don't see a reason to change them. Back here because I saw an item. Ooh, free stone sword key. Couple silver tear husks, nothing super important. Race. I'm very curious about. I'm. Um, I'm very confused about the sconces up there. Arranged battle. Holy shit. I think Night Comet goes through shields, doesn't it? No. But it costs way less. Or does it even? These cost way less.
Probably like two more. I'll do it. Ooh, got his horny shield. Nothing behind us. The Siafra Aqueduct. Where the hell is the dinging coming from? Missionary cookbook. I can fucking hear it. Oh, Jesus. Let's keep it going. Keep on a trucking. Ooh, gold. Order healing. Perfect. Strong foe. Okay. Oh shit. Why is that out? Oh god. Alright, we died. Well. Alright everybody. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. Feel free to subscribe for more content. Please do share the videos. We're trying to grow the channel. And we will. See you next time.